Hey, this is Mark Moore, aka Tuxedo Mark, at various places on the internet. It's 2.01 p.m. according to a computer clock on Monday, May 11, 2015. And uh, this is a bit late, but here's my review of um, Avengers Age of Ultron. Um, I saw this <laughs> six days ago on Tuesday, May 5th. Um, okay. First of all, I really enjoyed it. It was a good movie. Uh, is it as good as the first? I actually don't know. Uh, I don't remember too much about the first one. Um, but, you know, it, it, it was good. Alright. Um, the, uh, it starts off with an action scene with the entire team right away, so it gives you right what you're looking for right away. Um, okay, so Tony Stark's developing this this uh, protective shield or defense thing for the planet called Ultron, and Ultron is like an artificial intelligence. It gains its consciousness and. Uh, it basically wants to eradicate mankind, so this is kind of like, I don't know, Skynet, sort of, kind of, um, but, but it's just uh, a guy, like a metallic guy or something, voiced by James Spader. <laughs> uh, he, he has a lot of, like, quips and stuff like that, just like uh, Tony Stark does. So, you can't really take him too seriously, but, um, anyway. Oh, there, there's, uh, there's a funny gag near the beginning when they're having a party. There, it's just, you know, some downtime, and they all participate in a game trying to pick up Thor's hammer. Uh, except Black Widow, she stays out of it, even though they try to get her to try it. Um, let's see. Oh, um, there, there's this thing between Black Widow and, uh, or, you know, the, Natasha and, um, Bruce Banner that kind of develops. Like, there's some kind of attraction there. Ultimately, you know, spoilers, but Banner takes off, Hulk takes off at the end of the film to go and be alone, so then Black Widow and Captain America, Steve Rogers, are kind of like leading the team. I mean, Tony Stark drives off somewhere, I, for I forget what it was, but um, so they're kind of like leading the, the new adventures. I don't think this means that Stark's out, it just means that you can look forward to kind of like a rotating cast, kind of. He's going to be in uh, Captain America Civil War, which from what I've read is basically going to be like Avengers 2.5, so, um, but yeah. Overall, it's a really good film, and I, I like, um, geez, what's her name? Scarlet Witch. She's, uh, she's pretty interesting, and she's gonna be, she's a new Avenger, basically. Uh, well, she becomes one near the end of the film. Um, Let's see, Nick Fury shows up every so often, kind of like an extended cameo type of thing. Um, I would have liked to have seen some cameos from, like, the S.H.I.E.L.D. agents from TV, but, oh well. Um, they probably didn't show up because they've got their own little mess to deal with currently on the show. Um... What else can I say about this? Um, I, 
Oh, speaking of shield, I, I, I'm gonna derail a bit, but I guess speaking of shield, wouldn't it be kind of cool if um, Emily Van Camp's character from Captain America the Winter Soldier becomes a shield agent again? I mean, now that revenge is over, I mean, you know, she could jump over your shield. It's just the thought. Um, anyway. I think that's about it. I, mostly, I didn't try to think too hard about it. I just sat back and let it all come at me. Um, and I'm pretty bad at remembering like details anyway. Most of the stuff kind of blurs into like, you know, stuff's happening, you know, boom, explosion, st stuff's going on. These guys are doing this thing, these other guys are doing this thing, and I'm like, okay, yeah, whatever. Um, there's a s short scene partway through the closing credits, but there is no scene at the end of the closing credits. Um, so yeah, um, you don't have to stay all the way to the end. Also, I believe this was filmed in a wider aspect ratio than uh, the first Avengers film, I think. Um, so, not that I can really tell much of a difference or anything like that, but, uh, okay, I think I'm kind of rambling now. Uh, I enjoyed the film. Okay. Um, so, I guess so ends Marvel Cinematic Universe Phase 2. On to Phase 3. Okay, so uh, it's 2.08 p.m. and uh, that's it. Thanks for watching.